We recently went to Washington DC and on our first day we explored our hotel its Hyatt Regency to the left you can see metro station and to the right of the hotel there is elevator for accessibility purpose and also the hotel is pretty nice with all the amenities like they don't have microwave though they have it on only one floor the microwave which is on second floor they have ice machines and all the floors but yeah they don't have kettle but they have coffee maker and the rooms are perfectly clean they the parking is 30 bucks additional apart from what you pay but everything was good when it comes to the hotel the cleaning services that you get every day um i think the line and chain is on fourth day but yes if you don't want to go for the same hotel you have other hotels there too it's not just one hotel but the nearest nearest for the metro station and accessible to dc is this one so that you don't have to walk much that's the thing i like about this hotel i'll show some other uh, hotels that are nearby which are also in the accessible <coughs> accessible location to the metro um, and also there is Target and also Trader Joe's nearby to get some food uh, if you're hungry when you come late at night from DC because DC will be closed by end of the uh, after 5 30 or 6 so there's nothing much so these are the other various hotels that are available in case if you want to book apart from Hyatt Regency which have close proximity we took the elevator to go down to uh, metro because we have a stroller so we needed the elevator everywhere i couldn't figure out how to buy tickets so i took help for the smart trip card to buy smart trip card and we loaded like 20 bucks on each card for me and my wife and yeah after our train ride we did reach to washington dc metro station and from then on you'll see my second video how we did our complete trip thank you